even get to Ross. Yo, what's going on guys? This is PBMZ and welcome to a brand new video and showing you guys how to make an intro for your YouTube channel using Blender. So, uh, the first thing guys you're gonna need to do is just download Blender by just going to the Blender.org website, which is obviously the official website of Blender, and just by clicking on this uh, big blue button, uh, Blender 2.77, which is the newest version. Just click on it. And just play it download on your computer. I'm not going to do this because I already downloaded and installed it on my computer. But uh, so now uh, what you need to do is just get a template for free on YouTube. For example, I'm going to show you guys some. Um, I'm going to show you where to, where to get them. It's uh, actually pretty simple. So you can go. For example, I use iFresh HD. Uh, they provide you the best. Uh, free templates for Blender with their uh, amazing quality. Let's, let's open top top uh, 100 Blender into templates. Okay, I'm just gonna uh, pick a random one. Doesn't matter at all. It's just for the tutorial. So if you want to download this, just click on the just click on this bit dot uh, link, and uh, I'm gonna pick the first one. And uh, yeah, so it will take you to the download page. You, you can download this media fire. Uh, it is about let me see what it is. Okay, it's about 16.45 megabytes. Just press download. You just let it download on your computer. I'm gonna be right back after the load is complete. Okay, guys, the download is complete. You just uh, just click on the template, and will, and it will connect automatically to the Blender application. So there it is. Let's maximize this. So uh, to change the text, it is actually pretty simple. You just right-click on the text. After you've done that, it will be bordered with this orange uh, uh, line, and then press Tab. By pressing Tab, it allows it allows you to change the text. So you can delete it. I'm gonna type in my uh, YouTube channel name, FBMZ, and just uh, then right-click on the second text. Which is uh, this one be behind this one, behind the first text, right? Just click on it and uh, then press tab. Press tab to delete it. And once again, uh, type in your name. After you've done that, uh, just press tab uh, to exit it. And uh, you, you, uh, you need to, to choose your output. Where I want it to go, where I want it to save it, to save as. I'm gonna type it on my desktop. Any, any, uh, where in the desktop it doesn't matter. So with the name intro, and then uh, press accept. Right. After you've done that, just click accept, and uh, to to save some time on rendering the on to rendering the intro, just change the resolution from 100%. To 50, right? Once you've done that, 50, then press enter. Once you've done that, just click on render and then render animation. What this is going to do to do? It's just going to render the the intro frame by frame. It tells you how many frames the intro has. So it starts right from one and it ends at 220 frames. Uh, it takes. For real, it takes a really long time to do to uh, to render. It depends on your on your computer parameters, how good is your computer, the fast is gonna be. So yeah, just uh, just wait for the render to complete and just open it as a usual intro. So yeah, that, that's all, guys, for the tutorial. I uh, hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, just comment down below and I will kick them and I will answer and uh, answer them as quick as possible. So thank you guys so much for watching, I will see you guys next time, peace out.